In total banana I have here is 520 bananas. Okay. Yeah, I have 520 bananas in total. Yeah. Okay, good afternoon viewers. This is GAM Entrepreneur and I am Babu Karjuf, known as CES. Today we have for you a businessman, an entrepreneur, who is venturing into poultry. And we would like for him to introduce himself. Yeah, Assalamu alaikum. My name is Mohamed Juara, well known by MD. Um, I'm also a young entrepreneur, a unique versatile somebody, yeah, who depends on many things in business. Um, I don't only depend on poultry, I also have goats, that's what you call you, and other things, and I also have gardens, that's my banana farm, around the way the poultry is. Yeah. Okay. Um, okay. So maybe can you tell us um, a little bit about, you know, how you started, you know, especially with the poultry, and then we will go inside to check, you know, the banana farm and the goats as well. So how, uh, you get, how did you get into poultry, and how long? Uh, okay, thank you for that. Um, I, I also admire from people, like some of the time I have to go for site visiting for other people's gardens because I am, like honestly, uh, I started from selling lands. I mean, land, I, I deal with lands, where I bought, I, uh, I meet with many young Gambians who are investing in poultry and other things. So like that admire me much, and so I also said, ah, let me try. So based on that, then I, so I normally Google and see how people are doing in Africa, especially. So most of the time I Google Nigeria and Uganda yeah, and see how people are doing poultry. So I understand more about poultry through, yeah, um, through like I Google them. So one day then I also decided to start poultry. Yeah. So basically meaning that you did a whole lot of research before you venture into the exactly. poultry business. Exactly, that's what I'm trying to explain. Yeah, that's very nice. And how many, how many chickens did you start with? Yeah, I started with 10. I bought three from my boss. Uh, around Manjai N, the name will be like Ch Cham, Chow, Chow. Chow, like, yeah, Chow. So meaning you, you bought from Gum Entrepreneur? From Gum Exactly. Yeah. So he bought, he, he, he I, bought I, three Brahma chickens from Gum Entrepreneur? Exactly. exactly. Okay. I could remember that was around November middle. Okay. I bought three from Gum Entrepreneur. Yeah, I bought three from those people. Then, yeah, then I started from that tree. And I went to Khartoum. Then I also bought almost 50 from somebody. Then mm. this is how I start my business. Yeah. But now I have 720. Wow. In total, seven hundred and twenty within three months. Wow, that, that's yes. nice. That's impressive. I start as I as I, I told you formally. I start from um, uh, November middle. Now we are in January middle. Okay. So three months today, I am seven hundred twenty. Yeah, so nice. within one year, my dream is go to seven thousand. Seven thousand. Seven thousand. So that's so your target. Within three months, you have seven hundred, and within a year, you want you want seven thousand. Seven thousand. That's, that's impressive. Yeah, because like um. My father used to tell me that whatever the mind of a man can conceive and believe can be achievable. Yeah, right. So, and I believe in that. Mm -hmm. So, this is why I started from seven to ten. Now I'm seven twenty. Now, then in one year time, inshallah, so I'll go for seven thousand. So you have both uh, layers and broilers, yeah. right? Of course. Yeah. Okay. I have layers. I have broilers. Okay. Um, and I have the, I have different keys. Uh, Maybe you I can. have um, Holland Hollandaise. Okay. Then yeah, you can uh, you can come inside and have more. Okay. Every day I have the ones laying even. Uh, the one lines are almost 120. Okay. Every day I have five crates. Five crates, of course. So you have five crates of eggs every day. Every day. Wow. Yeah. For somebody who started with just with ten this. chickens, of you course, know, yeah. and within three months he's now having that. Yeah. Uh, okay. I already sent. Uh, I already sold my five crates. This um this uh, this have to be the sixth one. Six mm. yeah, for the day. For the day. Wow. Yeah. That's nice. Yeah. And how much do you sell the crates? One hundred and seventy-five. Yeah. One seventy-five. Yeah. Per crate. Per crate. That's nice. Yeah. <coughs> I have, I have um uh I have three hundred here. Three hundred. Three hundred. Three hundred chicks here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This is nice. Yeah. And I understand there are some inside there. Inside there, yeah, 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 exactly. And, and this is my lane. This is my lane. This is where my kids live. You can see the one lane. Yes. You can see the one lane. It's nice. Yeah, this is their house, but I, I do free ranging. Okay. Yeah, yeah. This is their house. When they when they, they normally want to come and, and and lay the eggs, yeah, they come inside. At the night they also come inside, but at the daytime they are also in the garden. Okay, so the garden. yeah, you can come and I show you. Where okay. Yeah. 
So I so I noticed before going in, you have to step on this. So this is bleach, right? Yeah, this is bleach. So he was saying before you go in, where's my bleach? And my phone on the trail. You have to step on it. Bleach. Okay. So that in case you know um, you are with any bacteria or so. Yeah, this is this yeah. is the bleach I tell you. It doesn't go in. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. So like he said, you see um, the room that I just showed you, yeah. it has a hole and through that they can go in, go, go in. out. Yeah. Okay. So hey, now let me ask you. Yeah. I do three yeah. days. If I land this, I I I I land this through Google. Okay. I Google some farms in Uganda. Okay. That man do free range. Yeah. What I understand in free range, like uh, when your bars are in free range, uh, uh, honestly, uh, they don't they um, they don't have disease okay. because even the air they breathe is very free. They are in the open place. They breathe free air. Uh, it's different from when they are inside. Inside the when they are contained. Exactly. So this how I I, I choose to work. Maybe like oh, that's that's interesting. That's very nice. These ones are my my, my brothers. Okay, the brothers are here. These are my brothers. They are one hundred and ten. Hundred and ten brothers. One hundred and ten brothers. And they are twenty six days old. Twenty six days. Twenty six days old. How, how long will it take for them to to be mature, to be mature. and ready for market? Forty five days. 45 days. So within 45 days they will be coming. Of course, yes. 45 days they are in the market. Wow. Wow. 45 days mm -hmm. they are in the market. Mm -hmm. And mashallah, uh, alhamdulillah, I have, I have, I don't uh, experience this still now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I have 110 from Bully up to now. I'm still 110. Yeah, no days. I have not experienced no days. Oh, that's mm -hmm. nice. So that's alhamdulillah, nice. I tell God. That's why I teach free radio. Okay. Yeah. So uh, we understand you also have goats here. Of course, right? yeah, I do. Maybe I this? also have goats. Okay. Uh, Continuous, huh? Yeah. Of course, yes. I also have goats. Because normally, during every um, every uh, Tobaski and uh, every Tobaski and every uh, uh, Ramadan, I, I normally uh, um, sell goats and chips. Okay. Uh, and ram, sorry. Ram, ram. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. You can come around. Here. No, not just in a level of Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Okay. Uh, that's my goat and sheep. That's my goat and sheep and ramp farm. Yeah. Okay, all mixed together. Yeah, I mix them together. That's nice. I mix them together. So as you can see, he's also having a goat farm with ram. All combined in one place. So about how many? Sheep do you have uh, here? Yeah, okay. I have 10 sheep. Okay. And and I have um, a 16 goats. 16 10 goats. 10 sheep and 16 goats, yeah. Mm -hmm. Different from the ram. I have four rams. Okay. Yes. I have four rams. Two bigger ones and two smaller ones. Okay. Four okay. rams. This, have is, four, this, is, yeah. this is very interesting, huh? Yeah, so, is, and as a, as a youth, you were able to do all of this by yourself? Yeah, yourself. Of course, yeah. MashaAllah. Yeah, because like, as I told you formally, uh, I deal with estates. So normally, when I have my commission and other things from the estates, then I have to go and, uh, how, how to call it even, uh, invest, invest in, in the other area before, like, yeah, because I, I say in the Gambia, there's money in the Gambia, if you want to. So I'm an entrepreneur. I believe in entrepreneurship. Okay? And that's why I'm uniquely versatile, so I don't depend on one thing. So I, know, I, I have this belief that in the Gambia, I can make it here. So that's why, uh, anyway, I'm still looking forward for more sponsor and other things. If I have sponsor and other things, I can go for bigger. Okay. Because I have experience in many things, go rearing. Because every Tobaski, I normally sell rams. Okay. Yeah. okay. So I can see you also have a tank here. Of course, yeah. Okay. It's like what what do you use the tank for? Is it for the garden? Yeah, for the garden and for the home purpose too. Oh, okay. Okay, that's Even nice. Even the surroundings, my so my my, my neighbors, yes. they all use their uh, yeah. I, I give them water for free. Okay, that's nice. So those are my banana. Yes, my banana. I have I have almost five hundred and twenty bananas. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Five hundred and twenty. Different from the seedlings. Or oh, even from the suckers. The suckers. So yeah. you you sell the suckers as well. Of course. Okay. Uh, I don't start selling suckers for now. Okay. Yeah. As a beginner. Uh, 
In total bananas, I have here is 520 bananas. Okay. Yeah, I have 520 bananas in total. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. This is this is yeah, irrigation system. Yeah, that's, mm -hmm. that was what I was even about to ask you. It's okay. Like you've done an irrigation system for the of bananas. Of course, yes. So I have to come. They will, they will be having yeah. water 24/7. I open here. You see water. You see water coming. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You see. Wow. Yeah. This is this is very interesting. Yeah. So you don't have to worry about no. you know watering and watering and all watering. Yeah. All you have to do is open it and so then. So I, I give them I give them some minutes like maybe less than thirty minutes and I come and close. Yes. Okay. Yeah. I have stock valve in in any lines. I have stock valve there. Any lines. Okay. Yeah. This is very interesting. This is nice. Wow. So um, let's say if somebody needs you know anything from you, either advice on how to start or maybe want to buy from you. Mm -hmm. You know, let's say some ram mm -hmm. or some chicken. Mm -hmm. How can they contact you? And where are you located? Um, anyway, I lo uh, my location is in Sanyang. I live in Sanyang, mm -hmm. around the primary school end. I'm not very much far from the garage. Uh, I'm well-known person. If you ask MB or anybody MB, then you will locate me where I am. Okay. Yeah, but my contact numbers are also as follows. You can dial me in my WhatsApp as 318-7555. You can dial me in my business number 22649-226412. You can also contact me in um uh, in my business partner number. That's my younger brother. He's my best friend. That's the boy here around the where the tag is. The name is Lam M I Jadama. He's also a young player who's also interested with me. Uh, the number is two three two three three seven seven. Yeah. Two three two three three seven seven. Okay, that's okay. nice. Lam in Jadama. Yeah. All right. Okay. So this was very interesting. You know um. So besides besides the bananas, do you have any other plants? Any that other plants that you normally grow? Of course, yes. I sell I sell seedlings. That's orange seedlings. Okay. Some people call me a uh, seedling seller because I sell seedlings. I normally go to customers. Okay. I bought seedlings from those people. Then I go, I come to Gambia then I resell them. You sell them. Yeah. Okay, that's nice. I also do that. I have avocado. I sell avocado. I sell mm -hmm. guava. Okay. Yeah, this is guava. Yeah, sure. I sell guava. Mm -hmm. Any any different seedlings you need, if you contact me, I will, I will provide it for you. So you have different kinds of different seedlings. different kind of seedlings. Okay. So this is very interesting, guys, uh, and this is very commendable. Having a young Gambian, you know, who instead of thinking of you know using the back way or other means, um, or you know just sitting in ghettos, he is struggling for himself, you know, investing and making sure that he earns for himself and his family. This is what we encourage, and this is what Gum Entrepreneur is about. You know, about encouraging young Gambians to invest in business, you know, to better their lives and the lives of their families. And those of you Gambians out there, come out to the Gambia, invest in businesses like this, help them grow, and also grow yourself likewise. So thank you very much, MD. Uh, okay, the advice I have for my Gambians, you know, like maybe I'll go for vernacular on that area. Mm -hmm. Assalamu alaikum, Balbi Kontunal Tunal Kondola, and the Muhammad MD Juarati, Mbora Sanyan Ne. Um, anyway, nje kani leke. So, but like, ko kumovu nyuwe pro ice ni ya Gambia stano nyaro nyadi na mfungo lugo. Mboke nyadi like ngami la nungkata nungbahwe. Five years ago, wale bol kabila mfunasi le ngaja kolo mo nyuli mita la bahwe ibiye kam kuma kina fanya. Boi wala nungkata dogo la nungka kete ne kabila somanda nje kafu nungka la football la nungka kete ne bete kafu nungka la dogo la. So, anana mfunana mani kolo kolo mfunana mfunana la dogo la bang. So, mbe dogo kile nyadi le wale ni kumbari ngai invest in garden. Like you see me like my age, well for the garden of the dinner at the old age. Because like I do go mean yinga, I symbol in yinga back for the neighbor for telephone. The janimba nyum pipeball sana nanyi satam and key ji one. Nga ji one why but nanya could like like um kuokuna water and a journey of hundred miles to be get and one step. So like sign the mother one step more other step like yo but me kumar and gambia kudo be the nimmo nyo nene. Why I'm going to invest in like Gambia, I'm going to invest in Yadile. Like, I'm going to try in a home. From the other side, a small piece of land, here in JDJ. Then, Alhamdulillah, within one year, two years, you are good to go. Here, I'm going to almost now start down in the other side. I'm going to go to the other side. I'm going to go to the MBA at the Garden of Start, August 10th. August 10th. This year. Sorry, last year. August 10th. I'm going to start August 10th. That's plantation of banana. 2021? 2021, August 10th. Plantation of banana. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.
Mais Thank you all very much. This was all we had for you. Um, so he is located in Sanyang. Uh, if you want to visit his farm or contact him for any advice or any business, the numbers have already been indicated on the screen. But we got anything before we close? Well, as usual, like I said in our past videos, this is GAM Entrepreneur and this is what we are here for, to market the Gambia, market the entrepreneurs in the Gambia. And don't forget to like our, our videos, subscribe to our page so that you can get more videos of, of, of the Gambia. Thank you very much.